friends, remember me from last week, Francis of Assisi. Impressive, isn't it? I don't see how anyone can look at a scene like this and not get the message of the Christmas story. We have a young woman, a young man, a simple place, and a beautiful child. Last week, when I introduced the Holy Family to you, Mary, Joseph, and the baby Jesus, I realized that there's more to the story than that. This is the true image of Christmas, but there's more to be said. You see, while the Holy Family was in a stable in Bethlehem, there were shepherds in a field nearby. They were watching their sheep that night when suddenly an angel of the Lord appeared to them. They were very, very much afraid. But then she gave them and spoke to them of a message of great joy. Do not be afraid of me. Look at me. For I am God's messenger bringing you good news of great joy. For you on this day is born in the city of David a Savior, who is the Messiah of the Lord. You will find a baby wrapped in swaddling cloths and lying in a manger. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace to all God's people. And then suddenly the angel was gone. The shepherds were stunned and amazed. In their excitement, they left their sheep and went straight to Bethlehem to look for the Messiah. We need that kind of, of excitement this Christmas. We each need to look for our own personal Messiah. Are you excited about Christmas this year? There's more to the story to be told. We've had shepherds, angel, the holy, the holy family. But I must go now and prepare more for this story. Until next time, may the peace of Bethlehem warm your heart. Turn your attention to the bulletin as we light the candle. We light this week's candle, hungry for joy. Joy that causes angels to sing, shepherds to believe, and the magi to worship. Joy that bubbles up from the depths of our souls, pink candles, and causes us to praise and worship our God with reckless abandon. Joy to the world, the Savior reigns. Let all their songs employ. While fields and floods, rocks, hills, and plains, repeat the sounding joy. Repeat the sounding joy. Repeat, repeat the sounding joy. Amen. God bless you. Thank you all. I'd like to invite the children to come forward with a few moments.